Hello viewers, be a glorious member of British Language and IELTS Club BLC and British and American English and IELTS Teaching Training Test and Research Academy by International Bangladesh Kajla Muthiar Rashi Center by subscribing this English IELTS Scholarship and Career Educational YouTube channel Bangladesh just now to get 50% mega discount and enjoy our 20 online and offline brand courses on English Language Foundation, Writing and Speaking English, English Language Diploma Certificate, Communicative English, IELTS, TOEFL, TESOL, GRE, GMAT, SAT, BCS and Bank of English programs. This is MEA Lord, BA Honors MA in English and ELT, First Class First, Russia University, Professor of English and ELT, Brand Ambassador of IELTS and TESOL, Bangladesh, IELTS score 8.5. This video is on English Vocabulary and Phonetics course, Paper 2, Module 2, Class Known 3, GRO 3, Use of Homographs, Part 1, Introduction to Homographs. Let's begin. What is a homograph? Homographs are a type of synonyms used for homonyms. They are the words which have the same spelling but different meanings whether they are pronounced the same or not. In another words, Homographs are words with the same spelling but having more than one meaning. For example, B A S S, bus. First meaning the fish rhymes with class and B A S S, bus. Second meaning the instrument rhymes with ace are homographs. But so are B A R K, bark. First meaning the sound of a dog. Max in Bangla Gilgukora and B A R K bark second meaning the covering of a tree in Bangla Gasir Bakol Basal. Similarly, L E T T E R letter first meaning is alphabetic symbol of a language in Bangla occur, but L E T T E R its second meaning is formal or informal correspondence for written communication in Bangla TT. D A T E date first meaning rendezvous or a time for appointment or meeting in Bangla Tariq. D A T E date its second meaning is small sweet fruit in Bangla Keju. B E A R beer first meaning carry bohan kora second meaning Tolerate, Shujukora, third meaning, a mammal or animal, Bulu, etc., are all homographs. Now, I want to speak about homonyms versus homographs and homophones. In English, a homonym is a word that sounds and spells same or apparently same as another word but fully differs in meaning. Homonym can refer to both number one homophone and number two homograph. The description of a homonym covers that of both a homophone and a homograph. They simply need to look or sound the same. Now, let's see the basic difference between a homograph and a homophone. Number one homophone. A homophone is a word that is pronounced the same as another word but differs in meaning and is spelled differently. For example, AD, ad, meaning poster, flyer, advertisement, and ADD, ad, meaning atas, include, insert, SELL, -L, sell, meaning auction, work, market, CELL, -L, sell, meaning small, compartment, room, alcove, apartment, etc. BY by meaning across beyond over BUY by meaning purchase acquire gain obtain procure WRITE write meaning compose type inscribe RIGHT first meaning 
equitable, fair, honest, second meaning, lawful, etc. are all homophones as though they are pronounced the same as another word but differs in meaning and is spelled differently. On the other hand, homographs are the words with same spelling and sound but different in meaning. Bow, bat, lead, fine, down, wind, tear, fear, close, desert, minute, accent, buffet, content, compact, object, wound, produce, subject, attribute, etc. All are the most common examples of homographs for each of them have more than one different meanings. Etymology of homograph. The word homograph originally comes from the Greek word homos meaning same and the grapho meaning right. It's a word that shares the same written form as another word but has a different meaning. However, some dictionaries insist that the words must also be pronounced differently while the Oxford English Dictionary says that the words should also be different origin. In this vein, the Oxford Guide to Practical Lexicography lists various types of homographs including those in which the words are discriminated by being in a different words class such as HIT hit the verb to strike and HIT hit the noun a blow. In general, identically written different senses of what is just to be fundamentally the same word are called polysemes. For example, W O O D wood meaning substance and another meaning area covered with trees. Guys, in my next video on BLC and Byte International English Book of Bibliary and Phonetics Course Paper 2, Module 2, Class 2, GRO 2, I will speak about homograph part 2. To speak English fluently like a native with international standard and get IELTS 8 plus score, you are most welcome to join British Language and IELTS Club BLC and British and American English and IELTS Teaching, Training, Test and Research Academy by International Bangladesh Kazla Muthiar Rashi Center. Thank you.